Hi everyone! I am super excited to be filming today. I am bringing you my 17 and 17 lip product challenge. So I do have my list here. And as I use up products, I'm going to be adding in new ones to try to just get through as many as I can. I'll go ahead and get started here with my first six. They are in this little IT Cosmetics palette. I got this off of QVC 2015. I know it was early in the year. It's getting a little bit older, so I want to just get some good use out of it. And this whole row here, these are all like lipsticks. And they're labeled on the back, but as you can see, I've barely touched any of them. This one is called Ruby Slippers. This one is, I uh, believe, this one is the Blurred Lines Lipstick in Perfect Nude. This one is the Blurred Lines Lipstick in Naturally Pretty. This is in Live or Live, probably Live. Um, and this one is in It Girl. So I'm really gonna focus and try to use each one of these up. And it looks like it's 0.34 grams total, I think is what it is. Um, but it's not a lot. I mean, they're small, obviously. It's just that I don't really ever think to use them. So I'm really gonna buckle down to try to remember to use these ones. Another um, lip product from IT Cosmetics, it's the IT CC Plus Serum, uh, a lip serum in Laugh. But unfortunately, this is not in any way see-through. Like, why would they do this? So I have no idea how much is in here. I just know that I've used it a bit, but it's pretty much full. I guess I'm just gonna use it and use it and use it until it's gone, but I have no idea how long that's gonna take. There is uh, 3.4 milliliters, 0.11 ounces, it looks like. Then I have my Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Birthday Babe. It was the birthday gift last year, already a year old, and I haven't even really used it. It's essentially brand new. Um, and I will mark all of these as soon as there is visible progress, but I think that this one is basically brand new. There is 4.5 milliliters or 0.15 ounces, it looks like. Why do they make the writing so tiny? Next, I have my Buxom lip, uh, full, full on lip polish, full paint something full-on lip polish in Gabby and there is two milliliters or 0 0.07 ounces in here again it is basically new I think I may have used it twice ever um, but it's beautiful it's this you know what I haven't been giving swatches have I let me give you some swatches of this stuff um, this is the buxom polish this mauve beautiful mauve color with like some gold sparkles and the birthday babe is like a peachy pink. And then this IT Cosmetics. So that's the IT Cosmetics laugh. Next, I have my Model Co. Lip Lacquer, and it's what I'm wearing today. Um, this is in Viva. Again, basically new haven't even really touched it. It's this kind of bright, fun, coral pink color, but it doesn't really look that way on my lips. So you can even see, I think there's a little bit of a difference. But that's Viva. There is 1.5 milliliters, um, so it's very small. And then I have the Mali Lip Magnifier in Punch, and this is a pencil. Um, sorry about the lighting, it's going in and out. Um, this is a pencil, obviously, and it's one of my favorites. Um, but it just looks like this beautiful, natural, but better, um, color it right up and it really does make my lips look bigger when I wear it. I have the Jane Iredale Forever Peach Lip and Cheek Stain and it's this bright orange in the tube but I think I've worn it a couple times and I think it's one of those that just like secretly adjusts to you so it's right there but like 
as you can see, the color is already shifting. So it really does go to just this beautiful, um, perfect, natural looking lip color for me. So it looks really funky on my hand, but when I get it on my lips, there, it's starting to change. Um, when I get it on my lips, it's beautiful and really suits my skin tone really well. And this one is just tiny also. It, there's only, this is it. That's as much as there is. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna save that one for spring and summer. Next, I have the, this um, lip balm. It is from Quality Choice Revo Lip balm um, it's one of those that's like domed and it is in the scent gingerbread and it smells just like gingerbread it's amazing and it says that it expires 10 17 so I have some time to use it but I just want to make sure that I get it used up I have this Urban Decay glide on lip pencil in ozone I have not used this maybe tw I, twice ever I don't use lip pencils, that's why I'm throwing this into this challenge. It is clear. Next I have this Makeup Forever Rouge Artist Natural N9. This I believe was a gift from Sephora as well. This is all the product there is. I've used it never. Uh, maybe once or twice, but it's basically the same size as when I got it. 1.5 grams. So. Again, it's just a small sample size, but even this, I think, is going to be a challenge for me to get through because I'm just not a lipstick wearer. Um, I mean, I love lipstick, but I just never... I don't know why I don't wear it. I don't know why. So I'm going to make it a, a point to wear this. It's a beautiful, easy-to-wear shade. Probably my favorite lipstick that I own is this Too Faced Nude Beach. I've barely used it. And it's literally like the most perfect nude ever in the world. So I really, I'm going to mark these on this um, paper so you can see any progress, but this is basically new. Again, I've only worn it probably a handful of times. My final item in this project is this Victoria's Secret uh, Beauty Rush Color Shine Gloss in Illuminating and I just got it and I've already used this much of it. I'll mark these for sure by the next update so you can see kind of any progress but as you can see I have been using it um, over the last couple of days. So there was 3.1 grams. Those are my choices, my 17 in 17 lip products that I plan to use up. My goal, like in general for the year, is to use up the stuff that I have instead of buying new things. Obviously some of these will be used up pretty quickly and some of them will take me a lot longer um, But as I use things up, I'm gonna be adding in more. So if you're gonna do this project, let me know Leave me a comment below um, Link your video down there so I can watch it because I would love to follow along with your progress And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and also feel free to leave me a comment Let me know what you would like to see in the future. Thank you for watching Peace and love